Hi everyone. I'm here by uh, James's barn in one of the best kept secrets in New Brunswick, I would say. So, sorry James, I might be uh, letting the cat out of the bag, but one of the most beautiful places in New Brunswick, as far as I'm concerned, is French Lake Road. You drive along, you see the big trees lining both sides, and eventually you end up down at French Lake. It's just a, a gorgeous place that God has made, and it's uh, a spot where, you know, it's pretty easy to be thankful. So I thought this would make a, a great spot to stop and be thankful for a moment. Here I am in the, with the wind blowing in my hair and on this beautiful day that God has given to us. I'm thankful. Thankful for two words. Two words that represent so much. See, those words are woven throughout the, the fabric of God's holy word. We see them really from beginning to end. There's the word mercy and all of that 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 represents and there's the word grace. And I'm thankful for God who is both God of mercy and God of grace. And I'm thankful for his mercy that has been applied to us. And I'm thankful for his grace that is available to every one of us. You see his mercy is spoken loud throughout the pages of the scripture. I think of that even after the flood, when the Lord said there would be seed time and harvest, summer and winter, his reminder to us in those words that even though we are sinful creatures, he still keeps feeding us. He is merciful to us. I'm also thankful that his mercy means that I don't get what I deserve. You see, sinners deserve to die, and because he's merciful to me, he allows me to continue on. And because he's merciful to all of us, he allows us to continue. But I think when we all think deeply about it, we realize that we're thankful for mercy, but we're even more thankful. Or maybe we could say we're super thankful for his grace. Because mercy means we don't get what we deserve. Grace means we can have something that we don't deserve. That he is giving to us something that we don't deserve. We don't deserve the new life of Jesus Christ. But he is offering it to us. And I'm thankful that written large throughout the pages of his holy word, he says, My grace, my grace for you. My grace is sufficient for you. He has offered to us his grace. What better reason for us to be thankful and to celebrate his goodness to us than his grace. So be thankful. Join with me in thanking our Lord for his goodness, for his mercy, Perhaps we can even be super thankful, overly thankful for his grace. He has offered to us new life in Jesus Christ. We praise God for what he has done. I hope you'll join me tomorrow at 10 a.m. Come join us in the sanctuary or you can drive in in the backyard or you can come join us online. I look forward to seeing you there. Let's have a thankful day. May God bless you.